Yeah, welcome to the next episode of my advanced Java tutorial. Today I will show you how to programmatically reconnect a uh, Fritzbox. We will do this by sending a SOAP message to the Fritzbox which terminates the internet connection and then reconnect and yeah, this results in getting a new IP address. So yeah, let's get started and all we need is a single class. I call it Fritz Box Reconnect. And we need the main method. So now, first of all, we need a string builder. So we will create an XML file of which we will send. So this will be stored in the string builder. Can be stored in a, a string as well, but it's more readable if we put this into a string builder. So I called it soap XML and I already does this before so I can easily paste it in. You see this is a bit more code. Don't be surprised about uh, the many tab stops I, I, I did here. This is just to make it more clean, more readable. You can also write every line here, everything in one line. Uh, but that more readable, so this is our SOAP XML which calls the forced termination web service and now we will uh, create our connection we will use in that address uh, connection address in that address get by name and yeah, by default, every Fritzbox is callable, uh, is readable over the uh, over the name DNS name Fritz dot box. So you can also add your IP address here if you want. And as you see, you need to uh, surround this with a try catch. So we will do this. And now we need our socket. So new socket and the port is uh, 49000 so this is the port for the web service ah, I forgot to add the connection address here so this is our socket connection and add exception so uh, now we will yeah now we will create a buffered writer. This writer will actually send the XML so message to our Fritz box. So buffered writer uh, bw new buffered writer, and this will be an output stream writer uh, where we also. define the uh, char set here with the second argument which is as already uh, written in the XML file UTF-8 and yeah, now we need to send some messages to our yeah, some messages to our f uh, to the thread box and we do this by yeah, we'll just copy paste this here so this is uh, basically just the header information for our web c web service connection, and now we sh uh, now we actually send the str uh, the soap XML from our string builder to string. So Don't forget to flush the connection, otherwise it wouldn't be sent anything, and then we will close the socket. So, this is all we need, and I will demonstrate to you how it's working. So, here is, uh, which one is the right one? So, here you see my Fritz.box administration interface where uh, yeah, well, you can see 
our connection, our last connection was at 9041 and a uh, 51 sorry and yeah now we will switch back to our application and I will start this here so yeah it's already a run through it's really quick so now I will refresh this page here and as you will see now 2005 so it's reconnected right now we got a new IP address so you won't see the IP address because I blacked it out but it has changed and yeah this is how it basically works and I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and hope I see you soon